Hello, I'm Nancy Carrier. Today we will be reviewing an example of interbranch transactions in Acumatica. Interbranch transactions are used when multiple related companies provide services or goods to one another. To record these transactions, typically the accounting department in the first company has to create and send an AR invoice to the customer, and the accounting department in the second company has to create an AP bill from the vendor. So we run into the situation where one transaction was processed by the accounting departments of two companies, all within the same organization. Let's take a look at how Acumatica can help reduce data entry and quickly enter the appropriate transactions for each company. Right now, we are working in a branch called Products Wholesale. But there's several companies and branches in this organization. In today's example, this sister company, Services East, is a customer of Products Wholesale. Let's create a quick invoice from Products Wholesale to Services East. Our customer in this case is the sister company. And we'll add in a couple of quick lines here. A couple of items that they purchased. Let's say they got one of those. And maybe we'll say two. So here's my completed invoice. And just like any other invoice, I'm going to uh, save it, get it into the state of balanced, and then release. So now the invoice has been recorded for branch product wholesale. But we want to easily enter the corresponding transaction for the other branch, for Services East. From the Actions menu, we have the option to Generate View AP Document. And this is completely optional. You can either use the Actions button to generate the transaction, or this task can be added to an automation schedule. So the corresponding transaction is automatically created without the need for this step. As you can see, a new vendor bill has been created. The vendor, in this case, is the originating company, Product Wholesale. And you can see the vendor bill is being recorded for that sister company, for Services East. Let's go ahead and take this off hold, save this bill, and in this case, our bill is being put through an approval cycle. We'll go ahead and just approve it. And the last step is to post it or release the bill. When an intercompany or interbranch transaction is created, it's very easy to identify. Let's take a look at the Financial Details tab. Under this section for intercompany invoicing, you can see the related document and you can easily view it by clicking on the pencil icon. So this is my originating document. And again, if I go to the financial details tab, we have a section for intercompany invoicing. And you can see we have a link to the vendor bill that was generated. So it's the same one that is right back here. And that's an example of how Acumatica can help reduce data entry reduce data entry errors, and quickly enter interbranch transactions.